Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are back in Icarus. Uh, where did we leave it last time? We had built our anvil last time, so it's been a few days since I've played, just been a bit busy. Um, can't we help sometimes? Yes, yeah, so we built our anvil, so we can now make some nails, which means that once we start unlocking some of the other tech tree items, so level 2 tech tree, um, things like the. Uh, where is it? It's on here somewhere. God, I forgot how long this tech tree is. It's getting longer by the day. The masonry bench, we can start making uh, stone bits which require nails. Um, but also, the other thing I want, if I can see it on here, is. Um, no, it's not the ice box, it is the cupboard. Where is the cupboard? Um, no, oh there it is, wooden cupboard, that one there. That needs nails as well. So that'll be one of the next things to unlock. And that will start replacing all of these uh, wooden chests. It's just a bit more space efficient using the cupboards. But as for now, it is um, 20, oh, 20, 30 minutes past 10 o'clock at night. We need, to, we need to sleep if I stop beating up my bed. And then we're back to a good morning, and I'm out of oxygen. Oh god, I keep forgetting. Change of keys, change of games, change of keys. Every time. Okay. And let's just repair some things quickly. I need some stone for doing it. Stone can go back. We now have um, our water skin, a proper water skin. I say proper water skin, it still leaks like a sieve, but it is uh, better than nothing. How's our fruit and veg doing? Oh, that was ready. That one's ready. Um, you'll notice the plots go, so the thing about using these little mud plots is that they disappear once you harvest. That was something I learned. Uh, fully grown, fully grown, fully grown. Um, I don't want to take everything just yet. I want to cook them up. Nope, they're already cooked ones. Where are the ones I've just harvested? There they are. <laughs> and the seeds. Just keep the seeds in one of these trunks somewhere. I can go in there. Okay, so... Um, in our last session, we went and cleared out the mine over here of everything we could possibly mine. We know we've got another mine over here, so I need to go and get some more iron from over there. I'd also like to sort of explore in this lake and see if there's any mines in the lake. So I need to be a bit lighter to do that. I mean, it's a bit too dark still. I know the sun's up, but I actually need the sun shining down in the water, really. Um, Come on. Yeah, you see, it's just all a bit too murky. You can't really see if there's any caves in here too well. Now, I have no idea if there is or isn't. I haven't been cheating and looking at the um, wiki site or anything like that. I know you can't do that, and some people do like to do that, but. I prefer just trying to find these things by myself. This makes for a bit better game, I think. No, I can't see anything around here. No, oh, I'm way up there. I'm way out the lake now. I don't know if that way. <laughs> Any 
Sí. They're not always the easiest to see, though that's the problem. But now I'm not seeing anything that would suggest a cave. They tend to be in the slightly deeper part of the water. And this is all quite shallow. I'm back around by my base now. So I guess that's a no. Okay, it was worth a try. There's some fishy chunks on there. Not sure if we'll still be there when we get back, but hey ho. Oh yeah, we also built our um, skinning bench. Which is help us skin animals. Right, which way am I going? Which way do I want to go? I want to head north east this way. Up past my um, dropship. And there's baby deer there, don't want to kill that. I don't mind taking them off, I've killed the mother, but I have to just take off the back. Uh, and see you. <laughs> didn't see you sneaking up with me, did I? You shit. Where do you come from? Right, which way do I want to head? Can I get around these rocks? Uh, better go to the left. One thing I do miss on this game is a little map in like one of the corners. I just think that would be really useful. Uh, oxide, I'm going to take some oxide with me. Never had enough offsite. <laughs> Stamina recover a bit. Oh, I could do eating some more things. Um, consume that and consume that. Just give me a bit more stamina. Get myself turned around here. I can't consume that. Right, which way do I want to head? around here a bit too high otherwise
So let's see if we can find this cave we had last time. Oh god, I'm well high. <laughs> I'll teach you not to pay attention to where I'm running to. Okay, I'm going to wall. What's that? Oh dear. I'm quite surprised I haven't seen any bears still. So. Get some light on the scene. That cave was somewhere around here. Pick up a few stones just in case I need to repair my tools. I think I'm a little bit too far south now, so let's just head this way. Oh yeah, there it is. You do get used to seeing these sort of shapes. I think I've told you that before. And there's the entrance, so... Come on, little wormies, where are you? Two of them, damn. Still got me. <sighs> Worms, bloody things. No, oh, they're getting all right. Give it a rest. Fall down. How many more want to attack me? I've been in here because I know there's a um, iron thing over here. Deep vein somewhere over here. There, there it is. There. And the bees are back. Go on, go and sting me. And try and sting me. Oh, he's got me then, no? Got you. Alright. Take that. Aluminium. And to American friends, yes, it is aluminium in this game, not aluminum. And I know Americans say aluminum, but there's a reason for that. It's all to do with some way a mistake in a book that was written many years ago. The inium at the end means it's a metal. Titanium, see, Eum at the end, it's again, Titanium. Let's start, we know what that is, that's some more iron, get that. And um, what can I do without? Uh, you can go in there. And I can destroy you, and I can destroy you. Oop. Destroy, yes. Destroy, yes. Alright, anything else up here? Yeah, there's more iron up here if I can get up. So we just need a bit of perseverance, you don't always need to use a ramp. I 
coat. Not hurt. No more up there, no. So I think I've got all the iron up there, just some more here. So when I go to the next level, if I get three points, two of them are going to be in iron tools and one of them is going to be in the cupboard. So I can. Uh, Increase my storage and get better mining and axe. Although you could argue that the axe I've got's doing okay, I'd probably be better off getting a iron knife. Come on. Just got it there before. Thank you. There is no more there. Good. That's uh, uh, platinum. See, inum at the end. Titanium, platinum, aluminium. I think I was made that point. <laughs> but yeah, I mean the reason I heard that um, the Ameri the way the Americans say aluminum was because I was a book written oh not long enough by the guy that invented or discovered aluminium. And um I did something with aluminium anyway. And of the I don't know, hundred references to the word aluminium in the book. It was misspelt one to aluminum. And it just so happens. Oh, crap. Uh, the Americans uh, saw that one misspelling and took it. Um, I saw why they would say aluminium like the rest of the world. Yeah, I've got um, pneumonia. So my stainless tank. But I'm nearly loaded out with spare ore, so I'm just going to finish this off. Tanked again. Oh, there we go. What have I got right? 117 out of 120. That will do. Time to exit. Um, look, before we do, let's just see if there's any more sort of metal around here. Um, that's copper up there. So, some copper in here. Platinum. Copper. Uh, iron up there, iron, gold. Yeah, there's definitely some more room for getting some more bits. So let's just head back home. Yeah, sorry ladies and gentlemen, uh, it's been 24 hours literally since I walked out that cave. Something came up just as I was uh, coming out the cave um, and I had to actually log off. So it's actually the next day now and I can't remember what I was doing. I think I was heading back to my base. Oh yeah, I've got um, pneumonia, that's right. So let's just um, eat a carrot, give us some additional stamina and um, berries to do the same. And I need to drink some water. So that's seven. There we go. Oh, what else has run out? Um, uh, my. That's it. So base is back this way, I believe. Let's just double check. Yeah, head this way. So yeah, sorry about that. Um, yeah, I kind of forgot what I was doing. Oh no, here's a terror horse. Oh, it's got a baby, I'll leave it. Or a boss, as uh, somebody called it. No. Deer with a baby. 
Everything's got babies at the minute. How are we doing? Everything ex oxide's okay, everything else is okay. Got some more berries just to be on the safe side. I can also use those berries to make other foods if I get the correct crafting bench. Uh, which is a cooking bench, I believe. Uh, let my stamina recover. Still no bears, so yeah, very odd. Yeah, my stamina's so low because I've got pneumonia. Um, I haven't got anything to remove it, so I've just got to keep resting very often and let me stamina recover. Otherwise, my stamina bar will be about three times that length. It does look good, this. The way they've done the landscape this is brilliant. Right, nearly back. Let's get across to my little island. I might have to build a bridge. See me swimming all this way all the time. Come on, get the water. There we go. Problem with building a bridge is um, animals can use it. Bears and horses or Deteronis and things like that. Right, okay, so we're back. How much um, iron and things did I get? Oh, I didn't get a huge amount. Uh, so how much iron do we have here? We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 116 iron and we've got 20, 45 copper. Okay, so... Let's put the two fifties in there. And where's my thing? Let's stick the forty six in there. Um, I thought I'd put some more aside to go in there, if I'm honest. Oh yeah, those. So just take those, put them in there. These can be useful for, these will be used for making um, steel bloom. Tree sap. Wood. How many tree saps I want? 20. All right, get some light in the scene as well. I'm very close to going up a level, so I might just go and do a bit of logging quickly. Oh, hunting wolves. Where are you? There you are. Oh, in the sea again. In the sea, in the water. Yeah, I saw you coming. I should have picked that up and chopped it up on my um, bench. Never mind, it's too late now. And there we go, we've gone up a level, which is what I wanted. So now I want to start making some iron tools. So let's go to our tech tree. Tier 2. 
because I haven't unlocked Steel Bloom and I don't believe can I do steel on here? Oh yeah you can do steel on there. And what is needed to make steel iron iron steel so you need level twenty so I'm only level eighteen so I will go with iron. So I'll go with iron pickaxe. How many points have we got? Three. Um, iron axe or iron knife? I'm going to go with the iron knife, I think. And then... Oh, here comes a storm. If I can find the other thing I want. Where are the cupboards? I found it earlier. There it is. Wooden cupboard. Talent points. Uh, I've got two available. So what do we have? Uh, increase yield from harvesting by hand. Uh, increase melee damage. Food duration lasts longer. I'm going to take one of them. Base stamina has already been increased. Um, and increase the yield from oxides and things. Uh, solo points. Got two of them. Got one of them. So I'll take the other one and increase my stamina regeneration. What kind of storm is this? How can my backpack be full already? Ah, food, that's why. So, you can go on there. And you can... Go on here for change. No fuel. There we go. Furs, bone, leather, oh it's got quite dark, wow, that's got really dark, so iron tools, what do I need to make an iron pickaxe? I need stone, leather, and iron ingots. No, I don't. I need wood, leather, and iron ingots. So take 20 iron ingots. And craft that. I can go in there. My stone knife can go in there. What do I need for stone knife? Iron nails. So I just need... How many iron nails? Two. So I've craft one lot of iron nails. I can then craft an iron knife. And he can go in there. Yeah, so the, I get a lot more from skinning on this one. It, um, it's 200% yield from skinning, but that one's 100% yield. And the pickaxe is 100% yield from mining, where the iron pickaxe is 125% plus a 60% mining radius. So I'll mine a bigger area. Now I'll show you those in action if uh, it wasn't raining. How are we doing? So we're going to have 120, 140 plus iron. 146 iron. Um, okay, it sounds like we're taking damage. I'll just set that run through until the 
damage stop, then I'll repair everything. Stone. I will leave the iron in there because it'll be useful for repairing tools and things. You can go in there. You can go in there. Um, Char, that's all cooked food. Bees can go in there. I've got no queen bees, so I can't set up a hive. Um, got leather, bone, fiber, wood, and the honey can go in there. Um, I'm going to craft another wooden torch if I can find the right one. That's a fire whacker. Floor torch? Where's a wooden torch gone? It's in here somewhere. There it is. I just need some sticks which I've got over here. Craft one of them so I've got one of those handy. Okay. Uh, let's put sticks away. Right, what do I need to make a cupboard? That's done on here, isn't it, I believe? Leather and copper nails. Okay. How many copper nails? I didn't read. How many copper nails I need? So four per... Right, okay. So I need quite a few copper nails. So I have to take five of those. Put them in there. Copper nails. Max. Craft. And I need more wood. I'm definitely going to have to chop down some trees. And I need leather. So there's the leather. There's the wood. And ropes. Make rope on here. That fibre. craft some of that. I heard the ding over here, which means my copper nails are ready. They go into there. So how many of these can I make? Three. That's a good start. Right, now we're not cooking. I will uh Repair my base group. That's done. It's K. Okay. That's okay. Stroll on level 15. When I can start converting everything to stone. I don't have to worry about repairing the base every five minutes. Okay. Got no wood on me. Right, where are we? Walls. That was it. could also do with building the um, textile bench so I can make myself a backpack which gives me an extra row uh, of slots in my inventory.
That's it, that's all done. Okay, so you finished. Let's just sort this out a bit so I can um pick these up. Uh, let's start with you. So I could just put one oh, like that, but then I'm taking up space. Could I get two in there side by side? Uh, not quite. No, not quite. What I can do is put two back to back. It's actually it's easier to try and get on here and do it. Like so. And now I don't need to be able to see the front of them. I just need to be able to access them. So that one bench of chest of 20 has now got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 40 slots. So I've now made 80 slots, the space of 20 there. Um, yeah, that, that's why I prefer to use these. You can just fit so much more into them. Um, I'll stick those back in there. Next one will be you. Just take all. Look at everything. Can I pick everything up? No, okay. Oh, I'm low on water as well. Okay. So let's just drop some things in here. Don't need you. Don't need you, you, you. Um. What's left? Oop. One short. Okay. Let's drop that for now. And take this. And then place that with she go this way do it from this side it'd be easier so and then oh come on Then rotate the 180. Like that. And that just means I can keep things like my oxide, my silicon, stone. I'll take that back. Um I just like to keep things separate, so or grouped, but separated out in each side. Grouped, but separated out within each container. So I keep my oxide with stone, silica, and um, silver, and then just the salt down there. So all the things that I can mine. Um, that's you done. So in here, I'm just going to keep bits that I no longer need. So that can go in there. Um, keep you on me. Okay. Okay. You can go in there. Now, what do I need to make more? I need 
rope, so that's fiber. So let's go and grab some fiber. Uh, craft that. I'm going to need some more wood, so while that's doing that, let's go and chop some more trees down. And try not to drop them on our base. Obviously, a steel axe would have made this, the iron axe would have made this a bit quicker, but um, as I'm going mining for more iron ore and things like that, I wanted the iron pickaxe. And I will get the iron axe next time. Yeah, so it's a bit boring watching me carving this up. Um, this will get better as I sort of get other skills unlocked and just get it to tov straight into my backpack rather than having to, um, you know, chop it up and then where's the rest of the tree gone? Yeah, let's pick some of this crap up at the same time. It's all useful. So, how many more can I build? Four. Let's craft those. And pick them up. And pick them up. Some food, stop it going off. Right, what have I got in my inventory? Um, a trophy that can go in here. Don't really want that on me. Stone can go in there. Watching food can go in there for now. Let's pick that one up. Oh, it's quite a bit in there. Um, okay, so we will. I thought I'd just put you in here. So not. Right, there's my next one. You can go in there the way. Wood, stack that. Uh, stick you in there for now. Sticks, fibre, and wood. So that means I can. No, not you. Take, actually, I'll take the charcoal as well. Fiber, sticks, charcoal, I want get rid of you. 
Do you? Okay, so I want actually for now let's just dump Oh you want to go in the other one. You wanna go in there. I'll stick that in there for the time being, we'll pick it back up again in a minute. And I take all get rid of that. Let's say uh, um, skins, bone, and leather. You're gone. So stick these in here. I'll probably just destroy these I'm honest. I don't really need them. Anything else? Oh yeah, fishing rod can go in here for now. Last one I will put Actually I'm gonna keep my last one just as a uh it's funny you can stick a cup inside a cupboard. Um just as some future expansion. So in this one I wanna take out the sticks, fibre and wood and what have you. Let's stick them in there. stay in there and I'm going to keep the seeds in here oh spade and yeah I forgot something to go in there and the old stone arrows Right, that's a, uh, sorry guys, a bit of sorting out there. Probably someone's to be doing on a camera, I might just cut through this when I'm editing. Um, fire, but pull that down. This is all together. And then the wood's all together. Okay, sticks, fiber. Fur, bone, leather, seed and plant material and charcoal, um, mined ores, miscellaneous parts, and bees and my other, I'll put ingredients in here, 
typically uh, my um, other storage container. So that, that's opened up this room a bit now. See, I've put six of these in and I made a huge amount more space just by putting them back to back. Um, they don't take up much more space on one double chest, but it gives you four times the storage. Uh, what we've got in here. Fish chunks, might as well eat them because they're going to go off. Cooked meat and um, corn on the cob. Oh, I've got no carrots left because I just consumed it. Okay, um, get on that. Deactivate you, don't need you on anymore. So I keep the oxide here. Water. Got my water bottle. Now the pickaxe, let's quickly show you the pickaxe working. It does work a lot quicker. The stone one, you can see it makes a much bigger hole to begin with. And I'm picking up stone a lot, lot quicker than the wooden one. And it lasts a lot longer. Like you see, I'm fairly sort of whizzing through this big boulder now. You know, I've got 50 already. Not time to stank. <laughs> Stamina stanked. <laughs> um, but yeah, not a bad day. We managed to get some more ore, um, get some iron tools, and rearrange our base a bit. So that's a pretty good day. And it's now ooh following day almost. So I'm going to leave it there, guys. Thanks for watching. Please hit like and subscribe. Uh, leave any comments below. I do have a Patreon page, which is linked below, and I'm currently running X4 Timeline series purely on my Patreon page. So if you're interested in that, take a look at that. For now, guys, this is Dragonfly Gamer wishing you good night.